Hi, my name is Eric Bailey. I'm an oil painter based in uh, Oakland, California. Um, I'm here to tell you more about my work and my process and thought process behind my pieces. Subject matter has always been all over the place. Um, it's kind of I change as I as I grow, depending where I live, what I'm surrounded by. The main main focus has always been this oil painting and painting itself as being a theme and letting the oil paint and brush strokes say a lot. So the subject matter varies a lot. Right now, it's, it's it has an underlying tone of Americana type stuff, um, a lot of figurative stuff still. Animals have always been a big influence for our subject matter. So growing up in like with skateboarding and graffiti and stuff. A lot of that comes through in my artwork, but as I get older, I feel like it is broadening and broadening the audience. I want it to speak to a, a pretty broad range of people. It's just a, just a capturing my life and my, and, and my growth as a human and what I'm interested in at the time and applying it to permanent paintings that will be around hopefully forever. So it's a direct reflection of what I'm in, interested in at the time. As I grow, I'm still trying to find my voice as an artist. So, you know, it's just a constant kind of struggle to kind of figure out where I'm taking this, why I'm doing it. It's not something I'm just, I know this is what I'm doing and this is why I'm doing it. It's always kind of, a, it's a journey for me. The transition of time and, you know, life passing is definitely something that comes across in my artwork. Painting figures has always been such a classical subject. It's been around since, since forever, since people, you know, it's always been a subject. So, it's just my kind of interpretation of it. Especially the, the female figure, it's, I think it's one of the most beautiful things there is in the world. So it's just kind of only natural to be drawn towards that. I mean, when I was going to school, I was experimenting with all different types of medium, you know, just taking watercolor classes, taking acrylic classes, charcoal. Um, but then, you know, with oil painting, I just fell in love with it just because of the richness of the medium and the, and the timelessness of it, how, how long it's been around. And also how in-depth it is. You can use it with different mediums. It's um, you can use it as glazes, you can use it as impasto, nice and thick. Um, there's so much depth you can create with such a, a simple color and linseed oils, basically with pigment and linseed oil, which is basically what it is. With such a simple uh, formula, you can do so much, so much with it. It just has such an old classic feel to it, which really helps portray what I'm trying to say in my paintings. For, for each person that views one of my paintings, they might have a different interpretation about it. There's no strong message, I wouldn't say, like as far as this means this, because to me, even, so I, I would try to figure out what they mean. It, there's not a, a meaning behind them, that's how the person views it. They can take out whatever they want from it. It can, some people, a painting might be upsetting, some people might, it might be beautiful or disturbing or, you know, just kind of, I definitely wanted to grab somebody's attention though. But at the same time, you know, it, it is all about the medium, the brush strokes, and that's kind of what the voice is. Think I'm a